All right, all right. Hello, everyone. And now, welcome. Well, not to a shoutcast or anything really Warcraft 3 related. Um, just, well, wanted to take a trip down memory lane. Um, some people had once asked me on the channel um, what was one of my favorite Warcraft moments. And I, and I was thinking about it at the time and I was casting and saw the chat, you know, scrolling on by and I was like, you know, I can't answer that. There's just so many to think of and to talk about. And I was going through the Blizzard um, art, um, Blizzard Entertainment art book back that was released back in 2013. If you haven't seen it, great collection of art from Blizzard and celebrating a lot of their, of the great things as my children <laughs> walk around in the background trying to take over this take over this short video all right would you please leave all right so why am i bringing up this picture um and well if you guys don't if you guys don't know this picture or haven't seen this picture um well you guys probably didn't get to play warcraft 2 um you know warcraft 2 at all all, all of those all, that just great great game and this particular piece was drawn by by Chris Metzen, who is no longer with Blizzard, um, unfortunately. But I was able to interview him back in 2013. And I had asked him, like, when I saw this picture, they had opened up a gallery in Pasadena. And when I was going through all of this hand-drawn art, I came across this particular picture and I kind of froze. I looked at it and you know, this this particular piece was drawn in 95, as you can see by the date. And I just kind of froze and it took me back, like a piece of art took me back to my childhood, um, playing playing video games on my 48 or I think it was a 486 DX100 um, um, Intel computer, uh, like just playing this Warcraft 2, this real time strategy game and a flood of memories came back. And I had the opportunity and I thought I had recorded this interview with Chris. And unfortunately, I did not get the chance to record the interview. There were some audio issues, but I had asked Chris this question. Chris, whenever you see a piece of artwork, is there like I saw this piece of artwork and it and a flood of emotions and a th flood of memories came back. You drew this. Is there any memory that that stimulate you or is there something that you see when you when you see you know an, an, an iconic piece of artwork just like this and chris said hey, chris like i was asking some really poor questions i was just kind of in awe of who i was sitting across from and chris like kind of sat up like oh my gosh a really good question and he sat up and i'm not gonna do him justice because i i couldn't have the interview recorded but he sat up and he was like yeah you know what back in that time Right. My my boss was walking around and I was drawing this piece and there was some other work that I had to finish up. And he's just like, aren't you done yet? He's like, oh, yeah, 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 I'm done. And as soon as his boss walks away, he like uncovers this piece and he starts finishing this drawing. And he goes, yeah, that's what I always think of, where when you are inspired by something, when you when you see great work and you're creator driven in in Warcraft or in whatever property that you're working on, that kind of bleeds into the image and you're able to create and be creative just like this. And it, it, it just, it was just a great moment. And even though I've had a lot of great moments in, in Warcraft 3 and Starcraft 2, meeting professional players and, and meeting some of the creators as well, and I think I'll always come back to this, this moment for me when Chris Metzen was able to well, I was able to sit across from Chris Metzen and he just had this joy sharing this story that at one point he was a young, enthusiastic, um, you know, just young worker wanting to create great games that inspired us. And I, I guess what I'm really hoping for is that Blizzard can get back to this, that Blizzard can get back to that that young feeling where if you create great games, the people will play them and the property will speak for itself and it, and it will be elevated once again. So um, I know Blizzard has a lot of things um, happening to the company right now and I wish them all the best, but I, I, 
I just felt like I needed to answer this question that was out there uh, that I never got to properly answer. So for all of you guys out there who follow this YouTube channel, thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you. Thank you, Evie.